Hey guys, in this video, let's set up HDRI lighting for our scene. So I have a character here that I'm working on, and he's just a uh, cartoon character just standing around. So right now I currently don't have any um, lights in my scene. So if I press render, you can see that it's just black. You can stop the render um, at any time by pressing escape. So how do we set up HDRI. So first thing you want to do is download a file from the web. So let's go to the web and in Google I'm just typing in free HDRI and I'm going to click on this first link here. Go to HDRIs and let's go ahead and download some that we could use for this example. So maybe grab a couple that you like. I'm going to just download them as 2K. And if you want to be more dramatic, maybe we can create a couple that look kind of different. All right, so once you have your files, uh, jump back into Maya. And now let's just simply go to Arnold, Lights, and let's go ahead and click on Physical Sky. Now when I click on Physical Sky, I have this sphere that's being created, and you can see in your attribute editor that physical sky has some uh, attributes already set. So now if I press render, there will be some lighting, but it's not the file that we just downloaded. So instead of using this default one, let's go ahead and plug in the one that we just grabbed from the web. I'm going to right click on color and break my connection. Then I'm going to click on color again, go to file. And let's go ahead and navigate to the uh, downloaded HDRI file that we just got from the web. All right, once you find it, you will see that it comes in and you'll be able to rotate the character 360 degrees and the HDRI file will be plugged in. So now if we just simply press render, everything just works. And if you pay attention to the sun, the sun is actually reflecting just like in the file, just like in the map. So it's actually using um, an actual true um, environment. It's taking the environment and it's creating the shadows based on based on the HDRI file, right? So that's cool. So this is uh, a good way to create really cool uh, renderings if you're interested and also including the background of the file. But what if you just wanted to light your character, but you actually didn't want the actual HDRI file to be visible in your animation? You only want the lighting um, information. You don't want the actual imagery. So to do that, all you have to do is make sure that your sky dome is selected in the outliner, and then in your uh, visibility, uh, in the attributes, just turn down the camera down to zero. And now if you render um, really quick, you will see that all the lighting information from your HDRI file is present, but there is no background. And this is a good way. So in case you want your own um, environment or scene, but you like the lighting of the HDRI file, this would be the way to do it. So I hope you found this useful and I'll see you next video.